this is the forward area where uh, we are at the moment and uh, just beyond this is gaza so these are the areas which are really out of bound for uh, most people they have been allowing media for some time but uh, it may be a matter of hours when this is closed for everyone because the surrounding towns have been evacuated if you look at this area this is the agricultural fields now you can understand the whole topography how the hamas managed to get inside hamas terrorists managed to get inside israel now this area has now been fortified there are bunkers there are firing positions which are here and uh, this is just one of them the whole area is now like this the calm has been broken the uh, feeling of peace has been broken and as far as you can see the roads behind there are, there, there are uh, military vehicles everywhere armored vehicles everywhere light infantry tanks everything this is the preparation which israel has done this is the preparation this is this is an announcement that this uh, israel will not back off retaliation has to be there that is what israel feels it has promised the leaders have promised to wipe out hamas civilians in gaza have been given just beyond this they have been given some time around 24 hours few hours have passed to move to southern gaza away from these active battle lines the expectation is that israel might go all out and launch a ground assault not only to wipe out hamas but also to free the hostages who are being held there from the border lines in southern israel kadam bin sharma for ndtv